Well, yeah, we needed to score a goal and we got only one, but I mean, against those type of teams, it's, it's hard to, to play from behind, especially like a couple of goals in, in third period, so it wasn't our best, best effort today, but somehow found a way, found a way to get close and uh, we'll, we'll take only good things from this and learn, learn how to play when things are not going the right way. Your team has been so prolific offensively. What was your biggest challenge early on in terms of what the Kings were, were doing defensively? Well, obviously they're a good team, but I think our effort, effort, it wasn't, it wasn't as good as it should have been against that that type of team, and uh, we didn't work that hard to to get to the spots where we can score or uh, so stuff like that. I think it, uh, we should have played harder, and we could have played harder, but uh, it's over now. We just gotta concentrate on the next one. Over five on the man advantage special teams a big story in that one. What was the most challenging aspect of not being able to execute? Well, there. I mean, we had shots. We had we had some few. Uh, we had few good chances to score. Uh, I don't think we did anything bad there. Uh, move move the puck. We got pucks to the net. We we had some some chances. So just gotta stick with it and uh, don't get down on it. Just stay confident. You mentioned earlier about focusing on the next game. Quick turnaround tomorrow into a back to back. What's the best way to reset and recharge to prepare? Well. Just, just forget about this one and like recovery and stuff. And uh, it's a good thing we get to stay in the same same place. Just drive tomorrow to the Anaheim, and no need to fly now. So we get extra time to recover and uh, get ready for tomorrow. Thank you, Sasha. Yeah, I mean we were able to stick with it and, and kind of get ourselves back and, and, and have a fighting chance. I mean you give them credit that you know their team when when they have the lead, it's not easy to come back on them. So you know I think they were a little bit more assertive early on a little bit quicker on pucks and um you know we fell behind and um you know i think just just come out with that mentality a little bit earlier and and uh you know try to get off to a better start to get, especially against a team like that it's down by two but you were able to cut their deficit finding the back of the net just how were you able to break just simplify i mean it, it wasn't going for us all all night um you know i think we were trying to do a little bit too much and and give them credit you know they they kind of bring that out of you and and you know that's kind of what we try and bring out of other teams so you know i think they stuck to their game plan a little bit better earlier on um and then we simplified and i mean that's that's going to happen in this league you're you're your, your natural tendency with the leads, you know, going to be to sit back a little bit. So we were able to get, to, to get on the forward check a little bit more in the third period and, and find a little bit more success. Special teams, another big story over five on the man advantage. What was the biggest challenge of being able to execute? We had some zone time. You know, we had some opportunities. It, it was just a matter of, of, of not capitalizing tonight. Um, you know, that, that, you know, kind of translated from our from our five on five game a little bit too. Um, you know, just didn't have it around the net, and then you start to trying to do a little bit too much, but um, you know, a little bit too much on the perimeter. Um, you know, I, I, I think when it's not going free, you, you you try and feel the puck a little bit more as as opposed to simplifying. And um, you know, they got some big bodies in front, so um, you know, it's easy to play on the perimeter. Game two of a back-to-back. What's the best way to regroup? That's, that's what you want in this league. After after a loss, you want to get back and and get back in the win column. So um, you know we're excited about the challenge. You know recover now and, and get ready for tomorrow. You've been scoring a lot of goals your team over this five-game winning streak. Tonight, what were they able to do to you offensively? Well, I think that's just their their game plan. You know we. You know, it, it, it was never going to be a 7-6 game against these guys. We knew that. So, um, you know, the, the, the way we both try and play is, 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 is simple and, and, and defend, defend, defend. So they did a little bit better job of that tonight. Thanks, Sam. No, we'll, we'll get them looked at tomorrow. I don't, I don't think it's significant. Uh, but we won't know until tomorrow. Not the outcome you wanted, but oh. what can you say of the fight and the sense of urgency? Yeah, I, I mean, I think we always will. I think that's that's who they are. All they're, they'll compete hard. I, I, th- I thought we were a little slow. I mean, that would be the thing that I talk about our game. I mean, I would expect them to be quick. They're sitting on four days rest. But I, I thought we just didn't move the puck quite the way we want, wanted to. And then, it, and then it's a tight game, right? Like, I think... I think the five-on-five five chances in the second period were two each team, so it was not a, a high. But both teams grind a little bit. We we won't like the way we move the puck maybe at times, and uh, at the end of the day, you go for five on the power play, and you got 
whatever, two, 217 empty net. Uh, we consider that part of our power play. So we're for six on that, and they were one for two, and that's the difference in the game. What was the biggest challenge on the man advantage? Yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't, oh, I mean, I guess getting some pucks through and getting some handles on some pucks around the net. I mean, they're, they're not going to give you the, we, 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 you know, on our PK, we tried to poke a puck by. It, it didn't get all the way down, and that came back, and it opened up a hole. They didn't make that mental mistake, and when we had, did have our chances, they, we either missed the net or I think uh, Hags missed the net five times tonight, but he scored the one, right? He hit the net once, and it was in the back of the net. He, he hits the net more times than not, so I'm not, I'm not complaining about the game. I didn't think we were great. Um, and you're not winning every game, so if we're going to lose 2-1 in, in a game where maybe we feel we could be a little sharper, then we just move on. Sam Reinhardt, a bright spot once again. Just what can you say if the consistency continues to show? Yeah, I, I think he and Barkov have got it going pretty good. You know, they, they're, they're different physical attributes that each has, but they both find each other. So those two guys played way more than I wanted them to tonight, but it was all power play special team stuff for the most part. I think they had eight minutes plus the two at the end. They're probably 10 minutes on the ice on special teams. So we got to get some jump into some other guys here for tomorrow night's game because I've run the top end pretty hard. Uh, quick turnaround, looking ahead to tomorrow. Yeah. What's the best way in your mind to recharge? Well, yeah, I mean, that part we'll have fun. There's lots of guys that didn't play that many minutes that they shouldn't be able to drive the bus. It's just somebody else has to do it. Might get a couple of players back into our lineup that would excite the group, you know, and, and, and you need a little jolt on back-to-back, -back, so... Uh, keep your game as simple and as fast as you can. You mentioned getting some players back into the lineup tomorrow. What has impressed you most about the way this team, especially the defense, has stepped up in a Yeah, you, you know what? It's been true of every game, and, and you would, you know, you, the expectation, I think, looking at it, we've been on playing pretty much, it feels like, every second night for, for November that they would have had a, a big lead on us in this game, that we would have had to fight back pretty hard on that. And then I, I don't think that the chances are too far out of skew. So we've been pretty darn good defensively, even when we're not, we got to scratch and claw a little bit. It's not going to look perfect. And I kind of, that's kind of how I felt of the game. It didn't look the way you'd want it to look, but you understand sometimes how pucks moved. And um, yeah, they, they compete. These guys will play hard. Tell us about your goalie. You give up a goal or two in a game, you're going to win your fair share. Yeah. Tell us about what he was able to do tonight. Well, that, that's what he's been. He's been real good. He made two, I think, early in the game, especially. He had some work there. And the second, it got a little quiet. But they were a little quicker on us in the start. So, the, the Sergey does a marvelous job of of sensing when we need kind of that push. And, and, and he was real good early. They kept it. And then the game settled in for a little bit. But he's been great for us, always has been. Thank you. Okay.